The think tank and the security analyst through their lawyers filed a 114-page writ at the Supreme Court with the hope of stopping what they say is a disturbing trend of such key officials being removed from office despite no evidence that they have misconducted themselves. They want the court to declare that the positions of Chief Fire Officer of the Fire Service, Inspector General of Police, Director General of Prison Service and Controller General of Immigration Service are sensitive positions that should not be toyed with. They believe such officials should be replaced only when they die, retire, resign or are incapable of performing functions of the office by reason of infirmity of the body or mind or that they are dismissed upon proving stated misconduct or misbehavior established against them. The court documents detail a tall list of officials they believe have been unlawfully removed from office. It includes Director General of Ghana Prison Service Imano Yawa Jato, who was removed in 2017. Elizabeth A.J., Comptroller General of Ghana Immigration Service, removed in 2011. They want the court to restrain or prevent the President of the Republic from dismissing current and future office holders unless the Constitution is complied with. It is not clear at this stage when hearing of the case will begin because the Office of the Attorney General will have to be served first before the court would issue a hearing notice for hearing to begin.